2023. It's already starting off to be very exciting. It's been busy and uh, there has been a lot of questions about a lot of different things. And I wanted to jump real quick into something specific, talking about what is called an Ulti Lean. I have already gone into 2023 and had a few customers where this is going to apply. What the deal is, is that when someone goes through a divorce and they have a divorce decree and they are in a situation where they need to pay the equity to that spouse or um, it's really a special type of lien that's specifically reserved for a spouse in a divorce situation. A lot of times people have to feel like they need to refinance and they're limited on their cash out to 80% loan to value. With this type of lien, they are not limited to that 80% loan to value. They can go as far as 95% loan to value in order to um, pay the lien um, when the, in the lien holder in this case is the divorce decree. So I have already gotten into 2023 and been in situations where I had to, you know, offer some people ad, some advice and uh, try to figure out what was the best plan to help with this specific situation so that they could pay the lien holder, which again is the spouse um, that is trying to remove themselves from the deed. So they can do a refinance. We use that decree as the lien holder, pay the lien holder, then you owe it free and clear. And just, you know, start, you can um, have, in, in, as far as the term on the loan, you could do a 30 year fix to 25. Uh, our company offers a 30, a 25, a 20, a 15 year. So you can refinance it to whatever it is your ability to repay to qualify for the mortgage loan. So that is an ulti lien. And again, now that we've gotten into 2023, we have a couple of situations where that is definitely uh, applied. And there's a certain time frame usually that people have on their decree to get something done. And here's my advice, the sooner the better. Don't wait, don't try to manipulate the market, figure out when the rates are gonna go down and do it on a specific time and not give yourself enough time because typically there is a time frame that you have to get it done in according to the decree. So you wanna be able to get that done, free your mind in 2023, I say that, free your mind in 2023 and lean in and let's get things done that makes life better for you and for your family and can just continue to move forward. So. That's my tip of the day, uh, the mortgage tip of the day, and I um, hope everybody's doing great. Like I said, Happy New Year 2023. Have a great day.